Hi, I'm excited to introduce a new supplier for us, APG. This is Brian Ritchie with APG. They're a company out of Salt Lake City, north of Salt Lake City, Utah. They sell pressure sensors, pressure gauges, ultrasonic level sensors, and magnetic flow meters. We haven't had a lot of choice on those three areas uh, in our catalog, and I'm excited to bring these guys in. Their, their product is industrial grade quality, fantastic features. Uh, Brian, tell us about your company. Yeah, we started back in the 80s and we started off as an ultrasonic level transmitter company. And over time, we've grown into just more than just a level company. We do level, we do pressure, and uh, we do flow as well. Most specifically, um, our ultrasonic level transmitters, um, not only do we have 10 different models, we can do tanks that are small as four inches all the way up to 50 feet. And then we have things that other folks just don't have. Yeah, that's what I'm excited to talk about. For example, you can have temperature compensation. Some people say, well, why do I need that? It can make a difference. It can make a difference up to 5% in your readings if you don't have temperature compensation. Also, we can adjust the strength of uh, the pulses going down and what it's hearing as far as the signal strength coming up. Other companies, you'll just do an auto uh, setup and call it good. And for a oh, tough good. application, it may not work. Another thing I'm super excited about are the magnetic flow meters. For commercial buildings and a lot of building applications, water metering and submetering comes up all the time. And not only ours um, is, is a beautiful uh, unit, it's a half percent accuracy of some of the most common uh, line sizes, one inch, two inch, three inch, four inch, and six inch. You just hook it up, you got a nice four to 20 out, and call it good. So are these in, are these inline meters or are they? They have flanges on each end, so you just put them in line and uh, super easy to install. No moving parts. So there's nothing in there but a pipe. Water's going through it. Exactly. Your, the sensors are embedded into the pipe. Exactly. No moving parts, okay, very nice. And, and magnetic flow meters are the most accurate meters for the HVAC industry, the type of fluids that we're measuring. That type of meter is actually more, is actually more accurate than turbines and targets and bullet meters, vortex meters, right? Correct, yeah. They're usually at least 1% or, or worse than that. And these, these are half percent. And if, you're, and if you're using the meter for billing, that half percent turns into a lot of money. Yes, it does. It's very important. Okay, so these are relatively simple products to order. If you know your pipe size and you know your fluid is something that can be sensed by magnetic flow. Conductive. Conductive correct. fluid, right. which in HVAC, most of the stuff we're gonna do is conductive flow. Yeah. Um, wall voltage uh, is always available. So I just need to know what size pipe am I putting this on? Exactly, and could, you got a four to 20 signal, which is the most common control signal yeah, out there. Yeah, couldn't be simpler, that's fantastic. It, it doesn't have to be complicated. These meters, we checked the pricing out on this, we're excited about. They're very competitively priced, even though it's an industrial grade meter. So we're gonna, so another choice now, that a couple more choices now that uh, are gonna be competitively priced. I want you to check them out in the catalog, compare, compare the uh, product and pricing. Yeah, we also have digital pressure gauges. I mean, we have some of the, um, just the entry level guys, if you just need a half percent, um, we get, got those. Then we got a quarter percent too, if you want, uh, four to twenty out. And then these are more expensive than an, in a, the, the cheap analog gauges with a needle, right? That's, That's true. It's accurate and it looks pretty, pretty cool. It, it looks like it's uh, the, the samples I saw were really robust made. I mean, they were heavy duty. Yeah, they're industrial grade. There's no doubt.